Let's get this show on the road. All right, guys. It's Stukrev, and today, as you can see, I'm driving my Conqueror, and look what I have mounted on my Conqueror: the 120 pounder, the tier 10 gun of the Conqueror, and this Conqueror is actually one of my favorite tanks in the game now because it's such a beast. The Conqueror is not about the armor, it's not about the speed, it's not about the excellent, excellent mobility, it's about its gun. It's all about its gun. And you will probably see why I am craving this gun so much, because I like it so much. I'm lagging the freak out here, but that doesn't really matter. As you can see, all my team is going uphill again. As usual, it's one of the standard things in Himmelsdorf. But as you can see, I'm trying to drive down here to try to have shots from this position up to the hill. So let's see if that's going to work. As you can see, I'm trying to take shots on the hill. Without un any excess until now. And there comes the tiger, as you can see. So I was thinking, okay, the tiger needs to be killed, otherwise he's gonna flank my team from the back. So, but I saw that I had a shot on the IS-8, but he will, we would be dead in a few seconds. And there goes the tiger, so I immediately go after him, as fast as I can. And just look at the gun, how big it is in the screen. It's enormous. It's enormous. It has a great great rate of fire and a great damage per minute one of the highest dpms in the game and you will see that just about the seconds after we managed to grab the tiger from behind but i think i thought that the tiger would know that i'm going after him but i don't didn't care see there he is he tries to take a shot at me <laughs> and a huge shot into the tiger. <laughs> wow. This gun is absolutely incredibly good. It's 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 incredible. As you can see we're down two tanks, but not for long. Only down one tank now. The tiger didn't stay the chance against my team. And now I was thinking, should I go back down? I thought, no, my team needs me up the hill, so I got uphill. They need my damage per minute. They need my great rate of fire. So I got up as fast as I can. And yes, you can see this thing is not very fast driving uphill, but it has good mobility, so... As you can see, I thought I would go left because if I can manage to get these the left flank ours, we can easily grab those guys from the right. So I was immediately heading towards this flank. As you can see, oh, one of those enemies got killed and we are even now. And I'm just driving in there. And there's an ice 3 I'm looking if he's aiming at me, he isn't, so I blessed one right through his turret. And now you can see the very good penetration and the very high damage roll of this gun. It's absolutely incredible. Don't have a quite good shot on him though. I tried to, but didn't engage. And that unfortunately wasn't a very smart of me as you can see the is 3 got a good shot into me but I also got a good shot into the is 3 and I immediately reverse as you can see now it's over for the is 3 poor guy he didn't stay the chance against my conqueror and there's a t44 which also will be dead and I love the new voices of the <laughs> British tanks. The new voices are perfect for this for the Conqueror. 
they are so symmetrical but as you can see the enemy is capping so we have to rush towards the cap to win and as you can see I'm rushing through the cap my team managed to reduce the cap a few times but it's not over yet as you can see there's still three enemy tanks capping the base and they killed one of my ally tanks so I thought let's kill this guy first he probably has the most capping points so he's taken out very quickly all the tanks which are here are one shot for me so I thought let's just take a shot let's do it let's just do it doesn't matter just go in take him out and then there's one 704 left and right now there's something really bad going to happen as you can see I've hit the gun mantler not a very smart not very smart of me I'm not trying to engage again but I'm going in I'm going in try to take the kill and welcome to world of tanks guys as you can see track damage track damage and the t30 missed so it's a high chance for me to but unfortunately he gets to turn his tank precisely on time but that does not matter anymore it's over for him as well so guys as you can see i hope i've showcased a little bit what the conqueror is all about it's about the high gun it's it's everything about the high gun and I highly recommend it try to get that gun as fast as you can but because it is incredible so guys I hope you've liked this episode I just wanted to show off the 120 millimeter gun of the conqueror and hopefully I'll see you next time